Bye bye. Let me leave. God damn it. Yay, I finally left. Digimon, digital monsters, Digimon are the champions. Change into digital. Fuck your wall, bitch. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. I don't know what the what the how far ahead or behind you are in, t in timeline. So like, it's um what? It's nine here, ten here, nine thirty here. What time is it there? I found the Digilab. How can you be connected to someone who's in the digital world, woman? Look, just let me go get my Digi parts. Let me go get my Digi parts. Uh, 70 hours. Yeah, is it AM or PM? I guess it's AM. Oh. God damn it. I didn't look at the digi line thing actually what did you say uh let's see here yeah yeah hi 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 um that's more important yeah yeah shut up um let's see here yeah so it'll be night time it'll be like late night your time and now i can digivolve a coromon into my battle in my into my team Aw, oh, yeah! Cormon stepping up to the plate! Nommy, nommy, nom, nom, nom. Let me beat you with a cog, bitch. I'm gonna dart cr co cog crusher you. I did not do much damage at all. Yeah, so like the earliest I'm going to be getting off in the future is going to be at about like 9.30 p.m. Your, your time. <laughs> I can't make no experience. One of the toughest fights to go through and it got me no experience. Ah, uh, you never know. It might hurt. Depending on what you gotta do tomorrow. Oh, hi guys! Oh, hi guys! Alright. So this tells you about the, uh, the data... The... The... Um, relationships between things. I am a virus. Which means that I am going to do increased damage against good old uh, data type here. I'm actually going to do double damage to him. Yeah. I do... I should have... Oh, no. Right. Don't you... Don't you chomp me, bitch. Okay, so I'm going to do increased damage to Beomon here because I'm using a lightning type on a wind. Now, I did less damage to her than I should than normal because she I should have I should have just used my uh, cog crusher, my nano machine break again. Um she is a uh vaccine type and I'm a virus type, so she does double damage to me and takes half damage. Okay, three rookie level Digimon should have given me more experience than 20 and then 12. Like, these two, these two are going to give me, a, uh, like, 28. And these are two baby level. I get the feeling that your uh, calculation of data is a bit off. Just, just die. You're, you're done. Just go sit down. Okay, all right, we are trucking along up here. Probably gonna be ending this in about 10 minutes or so. Nope, wrong way. Because uh, from what I know, it'll uh, YouTube will 
or I'm streaming this, so it'll go to Twitch, and then Twitch breaks it into about 15 minute segments. Yeah. Yeah, the two hit fights way more worth it. Now, the reason why I want to fight Agumon, or Koromon here, is because this is what gets you in, uh, Koromon, who did your balls into things like Agumon, Giamon, Toy Agumon. You know, really, really good Digimon to find. Hey, that one gave me 28. Pabumon! You're level... You're data scanned. I missed this chest earlier. God, escape gate. Oh no, you poisoned me. I'm gonna take you out in one hit. And nano machine break. Um, with the data, you turn them into Digimon on your team. Once you hit a hundred percent, you can convert them, which basically re uh, basically compiles the data that you put together and makes a Digimon for your team. Now the re uh. Now, one other thing is that you go above um, 100%, you can actually go up to 200%. The more you level them up, the higher their ability is, which actually makes them level up stats faster. And now I can convert Poyomon to my team. So now I've got three Digimon I could add to my team if I can find a uh, Digilab to do so. Okay, SP capsule. Yep. Um, additionally, I think the reason one of the oh, I found a uh, Tsunamon. All right, I'm actually going to take increased damage from that Tsunamon. Because he is an Earth type. Yep. So I'm gonna use Cog Crusher so I don't get the full damage penalty. Uh, Tsunamon is the Digimon who digivolves into the um. He digivolves into the Vmon line. God, avatar part. That's four avatar parts. Yay! I'm a real boy! You at least look normal again. I actually forgot that he leveled up like that. Um, yeah. I forgot that he leveled up into Beamon because... I always just figured he digivolved into the um, Gabumon line, which is what he normally does. Also, most of the dances the Digimon do there where they're spinning back and forth and whatever, most of their little animations there are actually tied to the music, so they at least, like, meet up with music. I've only ever actually bothered to run from one fight. And that was just because I was running through this area when I'm fielding a team with uh, champions. And I was just like, I really, I really don't need to fight you guys. Yep. Well, the music is pretty much always the same. Um, but what's an in it's just an interesting little thing to note that most of the Digimon have some animation that syncs up with that music. I always thought it was a really interesting thing. <laughs> Is it because I, I don't know, I, uh, 
Is it because I got the avatar parts? Is that why I bought four Tunamons now? I think that's actually enough to... Yep, that's enough. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I actually, um... I mean, I guess it doesn't matter which one I use here, but... Why waste the extra SP when I know I can kill him with Nano Machine Break? Zap! Alright, yeah, so I'm uh, just about done with this. Gonna head on back here. I'm gonna show you how Digivolution, or converting and Digivolving works before I call this stream an end. We're gonna come back here. This is, in our, this is our access point on the, uh, on the, digi on the mini map. You see how it's got the Wi-Fi symbol? Go to the Digilab. From this area, you can go, go to the Digilab, you, and this is where you take care of all the Digivolution stuff. So, when you ha have a Digimon reach 100% with the scanning, you can convert them to your team. 200% is maxed. So, I'm going to grab Pabumon and... Uh, he is a free training one. And Poyomon. Yep. I'll probably be playing this again tomorrow. I'm going to be by myself. Okay, so I'm going to move these Digimon... And they are now on my team, and I've, I've got three Digimon. Also, if you see down there next to their names how they have memory used, if you look at the bottom of, uh, below where my character, my Digimon are, you see I've got party memory, 8 of 20. That's because 50 Cent Mon uses 4 memory, Pabu Mon uses 2, and so does Boyo Mon. Uh, you can only use as many Digimon as take up how much memory you have in your bank. So, let's see if I can Digivolve 50 Cent Mon here. He doesn't... His... First Digivolution is going to be at level 18. At that point, I'll just be saving, hanging on to him until he can get uh, up to 20. Yeah, I would need to drop one if they had 21 points. Yep. Now, there's an item that you can get called the uh, Memory Up, which increases how much memory you have in your little bank really useful considering um higher level digimon can take up like 14 and 16 memory by themselves oh no holy shit you just about one shot poyamon there of course then i got two levels off of you Now, these data flow networks, you can replay, and you can just replay them to, like, try to collect the uh, scan data for the Digimon that you fought there, which is what I'm doing right here. Uh, no, you, you, there's an item called the um, Memory Up that increases your party memory. Um, one Memory Up increases your party memory by five. So every time you find one of those, you just get five extra memory. Most of the Digimon I'm running within my my offline file are actually like um. Yes, yes you can. That is actually what I was doing as I was trying to power level Poyomon and uh, Pabumon. 